Hey everyone, how you doing? My name is Echo and I hope you're having a great day. Today's Minecraft video, we're back on Minecraft Pocket Edition, the Bedrock version, because today is another Marketplace map review. So every single week, I think it's Tuesdays and Thursdays, the Marketplace is updated with new content, content that you can purchase. Now, I wanna make it my mission to bring you guys as many honest reviews as possible so you can decide whether you wanna purchase a map or not. Now, we will be doing adventure maps, survival maps, horror maps, if there is any. But today, in this video, we're gonna be checking out a map called Build Your Own Truck. Now, I seen this the other day and I was really intrigued by it, so that's the one I want to do today. If there's any other marketplace map that you're interested in buying, but you're not sure if you should get it, let me know in the comment section and I will do an honest map review. I'm not paid by any of these companies to make these reviews. That's why it's called an honest review. The last one we did was the Infinity Sky Block by Jagarbov. Now he is a friend. Although he's a friend, that map is still absolutely fantastic. And you guys seem to really enjoy the map review as well. Also, there'll be a link down below as to where you guys can buy these sweaters. All proceeds go to... Uh, saving bees and their habitats. Um, big shout out to Minecraft and Xbox who sent me this. Fun fact is, Mojang themselves actually donated $100,000 to support helping protect the habitats of bees. Because as they say, if the bees die, humans die. So I'm doing this on Windows 10. You can check this out on iOS, Android, Windows 10, Xbox, Switch. And of course, welcome to the community PlayStation 4 players. So like I said guys, every single day stuff is introduced. You will see the new logo constantly. Um, to be honest, there's a lot of good content here and it will get better over time. Some of them are still questionable. I did find another one, and I don't, I don't wanna hate on it too much, but it's advanced furniture. Coming in at a price of £6.69. The problem with things like this is that the furniture is stuck to that one world. I did do a review of something very similar to this as well, and they do not outline in here that it's locked to one world whatsoever. That is some of the most expensive content I've seen on the marketplace. All right, so if we tap on search, we're just gonna type in truck. So, no, that's wrong. I think it's called build. So we type in build instead. Yeah, so you've got a couple of different build things here. Uh, Blitz build, blitz build again. This is what we're gonna be checking out. It's called build your truck. We've got build your own castle. That also seems quite interesting. So the one we're checking out today comes in at a price of 990 Minecraft coins, which translate in my currency to four pound 99, so five pounds. You're talking six or seven dollars, which again is quite expensive for one specific map. Now it is created by Pathway Studios and I believe I have checked out stuff by them before and I was not disappointed. The description behind this reads, gear up and roll out, design your custom truck by combining parts however you want, then drive them into the city to explore, unlock new parts and make even cooler trucks. Big trucks you can actually drive includes 56 different parts from dump trucks, buses, fire trucks and more. So I like the idea behind that. Millions of possible combinations, make it your own by Mr. Squishy. He he, I've, I've downloaded stuff from Mr. Squishy before. Before he was a Marketplace partner, he used to release a lot of uh, add-ons to the community and Pathway Studios. So, we'll get a little, a little bit of a glimpse at this. Um, the trailer was actually really cool. I was quite impressed with the trailer. This is the truck I'm guessing you start off with. Fire trucks and buses, monster truck. And then you've got dump trucks and I think that's like a cement mixer as well. And I'm not sure what this one is. That's a really mini one. And this is what the map looks like. This map reminds me of the Hunger Games map where you're in the city. You've probably seen it before because it has like an airplane section as well. Uh, it looks very, very similar. So at the moment, I'll be making this. No ratings or anything like that. Um, how many downloads does it has? I mean, it's got nothing here either. So we might be some of the first people to check this out and review it. It could be absolutely fantastic. Sometimes content like this gets buried under other content. Right, let's buy it, let's load up the map, and let's see what it has in store for us. Okay, so this is the starting point. It's obviously your your garage, where you start to create your own truck. Now, I did see this straight away. So, ah, okay, welcome to build your truck. 
Time to get your first truck. Okay, I don't think I was to find it. Ah, there are three part. There are three truck parts around the shop. Find and punch three part trucks to unlock them. Okay, truck parts. All right, so we found this one pretty easily. So this is obviously the tires, isn't it? So let's punch this one. Okay. Uh, light blue wheels unlocked. You found one of the parts. Only two to go. Okay. Well, there's another one. But before we go over there, let's go and check this up here. This one is... Okay, this is quite pretty cool. Tow truck. All right, well, I guess we're going to start off with the tow truck itself. I wonder if there's any Easter eggs, though. I feel like maps like this could have some Easter eggs. All right, and I'm guessing, last but not least, it's going to be this one. So nine of them to find. Nine of them to find. 13 of them to find, and 6 of them to find. So you do have a lot of different combinations, and I think there is going to be quite a few hours of uh, excitement in here. Can you move these? No. All right, you found all three parts. Your new truck is awaiting for you. There are more than 30 parts hidden around the city. Use the part menu by the gate to install new parts to find. Have fun. Ah! So this is our truck. Wait, wait, can we ride? Can we drive this? Oh, dude. Oh, ho, ho, ho. look at my new wheels. Dude, that's so cool. All right. Hold on. Hold on. Let's just leave this here for now. Let's, let's leave that there for now. Okay, so. Oh. Now, that's actually a really cool idea. So, these are the things that we are needing to find. That being the front of the, the vehicle. So, if we go back. Ah, it's really easy to do. It's really easy to use as well. So, you've got your front wheels. The size of them, they're monster wheels, which they're the ones that we've already found. So there's even tinier ones to find as well. So what else do we have? Front. So these are like cosmetic. I don't even know what that is. What's that meant to be? I don't know what that is. That's obviously a ladder. I, I don't even know what they are meant to be. And we've got back. So this is the one I'm more excited about. So you can pick your design. What is that? Is that like an ice cream truck? <laughs> that one's like, um, like burgers and stuff and hot dogs. And then you've got this one as well. All right, so we need to go and find a bunch of resources here. This is going to tell you how many you've actually found. So what I, I don't even know what this is for. But I'm going to take one just in case I need to take this with me. All right, into the truck we go. What up, Pulsey? I think it's a lot easier to drive trucks this way. I'm guessing we're going to have to stick to the roads as well. I think we found one. We have found one. What is this? Boss. Okay, so we found a bus. I hope they're a little bit harder to find. I don't want everything to be incredibly easy to find. The good thing about wells like this, though, is if you really wanted to, you could go past the borders. Obviously, when you've gone past the borders, you will then be able to, I don't know, create your own survival experience. All right, let's continue down here then. I'll tell you what, some of these trucks, are, some of them are kind of hard to, to, to control. Let's go over here. What's this one? bus back. So we've unlocked the back of it as well. I think things might also be inside of these houses. Ah, wait, what's this? I don't know. I don't quite know what that's meant to be. I feel like some of the things, I feel like some of the things are going to be locked. Have I just got myself stuck inside of here? No. <laughs> okay, we need to go find some more parts. So I did just see one right behind us. There's also, is that, is that one on the roof? Oh, that is on the roof. Yo, I think, what is that meant to be? I feel like that's meant to be like a car engine or something like that. All right, well, I did find another one. I actually don't know why I got out my vehicle there. Obviously, a little bit fast. There is a lot of horses. I'm not quite sure why there's a lot of horses in the city. I don't think that's quite safe. Uh, but I also noticed we have this one as well. So I think if we go to specific locations, like that's meant to be like the bus station. We're going to find the corresponding parts. We found the cement mixer as well. Yeah, so if you're looking for, let's say, building things like the cement mixer, you're going to find... There's another one all the way up there. So, okay, I didn't realize they were going to be that high up. All right, well, we need to we need to get ourselves up here. Let's hope this is a little bit easier. Yeah, okay, it's straight up. All right, let's go grab this. It's even higher. It's all the way up here. All right, well, you're going to have to make one leap of faith right there. So be very careful. I'll tell you what though, this is going to give us a real big bird's eye view of maybe trying to find- There's another one, okay. So you are able to find things. The city really isn't that big though. Or the town or wherever it's meant to be. It's, it's quite small. 
But like I said, with things like this, you are able to go past the borders and I guess take your truck with you in a way. Um, all right, well, we need to get back down. I'm really, tempt I'm really tempted to jump. I know it's on peaceful. There's another one down there. Let's not jump because I'll get myself killed. Okay, there is parts absolutely everywhere here. All right, so this is the one I kind of wanted. So it's kind of come to me that they want you to find these pieces because they want you to build the trucks rather than adventure. I would say it's not really much of... How, how do we get... I think it's over here. It's not really much of an adventure kind of map. It's more they want you to build the trucks and, and mess around with it, which I could understand why. I think it'll be a little bit more enjoyable. How... Oh, okay. So there is a couple... A little bit of jumping you're going to have to do. A little bit of parkour in this structure that is no longer... How do we... Okay. All right. We're going to have to go this way. In this structure, which is still being built. All right. Well... I want to kind of figure out how many pieces. Let's not die, please. Oh, that nearly ended a lot worse. <laughs> I'm going to gather a couple more pieces. I'm more interested in building some of these things. There's definitely another piece somewhere. I can't remember exactly where it was. It might actually be on this building. So this is a pretty cool addition. It is parkour. So it's adventure, parkour... Plus, build your own kind of truck and it gets a little bit harder. So I reckon like the better stuff might be a little bit higher up. Because if I do this and there's nothing here. Yeah, there is something here. Okay, so I guess the better parts are a little bit higher up. There we go. We made it. And we got another one here as well. Okay. So this one is orange giant wheels. So we found that one. We found this one. I don't think there's any way to get a little bit higher. There's definitely going to be more around here. This seems to be like the main place we are finding things. All right, let's go back. So I want to go and check how many that we actually have. So I really like the fact that it does update. We've got three, let's just say parts for the front, three for the back, three types of wheels, and only one out of six. I think that's like things that can go on top of your truck. So we still got a lot more to find. And I still think it would take me quite some time to find a uh, new parts menu. All right, no chop, no no truck in the shop. Okay, well we're gonna put this here. Let's try it again. All right, there's not nothing in here. Can we not change these? Why don't we go with a bus? Oh, okay. <laughs> All right, so we've got a bus design with a tow truck. Yeah, this is where things are gonna get interesting. Oh, this is where you can change it. What about this one? Yeah, dude, I like that one. <laughs> okay, let's go back. We've got wheels. Can we give them like giant wheels? Can we give them giant wheels? Oh, giant wheels on the front. What about the back? Oh, dude, look at this tow truck. They are monster truck wheels. So we really do need to try and find ourselves the monster truck. And then we've also got a ladder as well. Oh, you can put a ladder on the front. <laughs> that most certainly is not safe. But we'll put it on there. And then we've got... We've already done the back, haven't we? Have we done the back? We've done the back, right? Maybe we put a cement mixer on there. Yeah, there we go. That's more like it. And then we've got... I think that's it. The back. There you go. Look, check out my new wheels. I, w I wish there was a way to change colors, though. Like, I'm a sucker for red. I, would, I wanted a red truck. But it still looks pretty cool. Oh, it's nighttime. Wait, do we have a bed? I don't know if, I, yeah, um, okay, well, I guess, well, I guess we can be on night shift. Let's check out this, oh, this thing is huge. This thing is absolutely huge. All right, so we kind of went left. Let's go right a little bit more. Dude, look at the size of this thing, dude. It's so cool. All right, I like it. Ever wanted to have a truck in Minecraft? That's the wrong way. Ever wanted to have a truck in Minecraft? This is the one. I hear beeping, but I think it's automatic. I don't think I'm necessarily doing it. And there might be something up there as well. Okay, well, we're gonna... Ah, here's another one. All right. So, yeah, these, some of these parts are really easy. And there's one of those ones. I like that one. Garbage truck. We're gonna be the garbage collector. Is there actually anything inside of here, though? Not quite. So, some of the, most of the parts are a little bit higher up. Oh, that's a lie. Nope, we found ourselves extra wheels. So, I think it's... I think we have more wheels than anything else. I think it's wheels... 
you're gonna find yourself searching a lot for. Man, I'm trying to find a bed. Uh, I don't want to deal with night time. I don't like night shift. So I think this, is this an ice cream truck kind of one? I think it might be. The ice cream truck, it, I knew it was. So we found an ice cream truck. All right guys, I'm just, wait, there's a little, uh, there's a little cave down here. Something tells me that there might be some wheels down here. Wait, what's this? Okay, well, we'll take a pickaxe in case we need it. Where are you? No, I might just be just a random mine. No, there was light at the end of the tunnel. So this is like a rarity. Ice cream cone decoration. So that's going to be for the back. So it was worth exploring these ones. So yeah, guys, there's going to be parts absolutely everywhere. This would be a really fun thing to do with your friends. However, the question is, are you able to customize more than one truck in a game? So for example, you have your own truck and your friend has their own truck. Am I lost here or is this the right way out? Nope, there's my uh, my new wheels. All right, well, I do want to continue to try and find more wheels because there's a lot of them to be found. So we'll change my truck again. We found five out of nine, three out of nine, four and two parts. We can continue to change this. So we want to, I want to be an ice cream truck driver. Long, long, <laughs> ice cream truck with, with a cement mixer. What a lovely combination. What was this one though? Oh no, I do like that one. That would fit really well. But we'll go with we'll go with we'll go with ice cream truck because I like that one. And then we'll go with. Did we find anything else? With the, oh, we found an ice cream tro uh, cone, didn't we? Can we have more than? Oh, can you have more than one on? Oh, you can put multiple on. Unless that does that take it off? No, they're both on, aren't they? At the same time. <laughs> uh, let's take this off. That looks so weird. Oh look, so, so strange. I'm gonna keep them both on though. So if you really wanted to, you could put them all on together. Do we get any more things? The, that's, that's the, the front. What about the back? Wait, can, can we have like... Oh, you can put an ice cream cone on the front too! What about... Can you have more than one of these on? No, that one does physically change them, okay. And then front wheels. I kind of want to have really tiny wheels in the front. Yeah. Because it doesn't make sense. And then we've got really big ones on the back. <laughs> Look at that. That is like... I don't know. That would definitely not be road safe. So we, we've only got a couple more of these to find. This one is a garbage truck. That's a pretty good one as well. So there is multiple stations as to where you can change your wheels and stuff. So I like that. There's more than one. You're not having to go to the same place because the town, although I think it's a little bit on the small side, it is still pretty big for to, having to go back to the same locations all the time. Um, okay. I guess I have to work here now. Is it the ice cream? Is it the ice cream shop? I don't know what kind of shop this is. Another one, another front. This is like a lorry. Yeah, big rig. It's that, okay. Still no sign of the monster truck one though. Unless that, that was it. And what's this one? Found another one out back. Oh, and another part as well. Big rig. I guess all the big rig parts are around here. I, ah, okay. So you're gonna have to go up. See, I was up on a building like this before. I actually thought it was gonna be where all the things are. It turns out it's not, unless I missed it. Now let's go with this. So this one is more big rig. Ah, exhaust pipe decoration. All right, so we are starting to find more parts. It would have been nicer to have like maybe something here or something here with commands that actually tells you how many parts you have. Because in order for me to tell how many parts I have, I have to go back to to the building. I don't know if that's even possible on the bedrock version yet where you're able to to track it though. But let's, let's keep checking out because there's been, what, three parts in this place so far? Okay, so we found some new wheels. That's always a good sign, right? There we go. We unlocked some pink double wheels. I gotta show you guys, like, I, I can't really show you too much in this one. Cause it's so, it's such a big truck. Driving it around is, is, is quite difficult. And, uh, oh, it, it, it jumps. We have a jumping truck. I, I can't get out of here. Okay, there we go. Let's get back up here. It's becoming daytime as well. There's still a lot more parts. Is that? Uh, no, that's just another horse. There's a lot of horses in this world. 
this one might well be the last front. I know I've said that like two or three times before we found a van. Ah, okay. Well, with us finding a van, there is a lot of parts inside of this one. Van back. So it seems a lot of the parts for the specific trucks are linked together. That's why we found a lot of the big rigs together. But the cool thing is you don't have to just have a big van or have a big truck. You're able to combine them all together and end up with like <laughs> something majestic like that. There's, I reckon there could be something on the ceiling in this one though. Sorry, on the roof. Or something maybe in here. Because one thing I'm not finding many of is the wheels. They seem to be uh, escaping me. That one's still up there. I think we'll go and get that. But I have not checked this part of town, so we'll come back around in my wheels. Oh, okay. I actually managed to miss this one. Fire truck. So this is definitely one part of town we have not been to. We found fire truck parts. We actually found ourselves some silver wheels as well. We need it. Get ourselves to the roof. And I think the way you get to the roof is this way. Nope, we've already been that way. Um, <laughs> there might be a ladder on the outsides somewhere, I, I hope. Because I don't know how to get there. Because we don't... Oh, there's another one on top of there as well. Alright, well, we need to make sure we get these parts. There was a ladder. I think most of these buildings are going to have ladders. So this one I was really confused by because I wasn't quite sure what this one was going to be. Warning flasher. And then you've got that over there as well. Is there any more on the high top buildings that we haven't seen? Maybe on this one? Nope. I don't think so. Okay. Well, I want to definitely go and get that one as well. The more combinations we have, the better it's going to be. Okay. It's another set of wheels. White wheels unlocked. Look at that truck, man. Please don't die. Okay, we're good. All right, so I'm gonna go back to this. I wanna go back to the, the truck shop now because I wanna see what we can actually build. And I think there's another one here where we can build. Yeah, okay, okay. So within the time of me doing this, which it isn't too long. We haven't been playing for too long. We managed to find eight out of nine, seven out of nine, seven out of 13, and five out of six. Which I think isn't too bad. Now in terms of this kind of map, right? The customizations are absolutely brilliant. I think building your own truck is brilliant. Like I said, if you could get more than one truck in here with your friends, it would be even better. I will check if this map is actually... Uh, we'll back out for a second. We will check if this map is multiplayer as well as solo. On your own, it's not as it's not as enjoyable. I'm having fun finding a couple of things, but I think after a little bit of time, it would become in incredibly boring. So if we go to build again, um, does it say it's multiplayer? See, it doesn't. That's the thing. A lot of these maps don't outline if they're simply solo or multiplayer. It would be so much better if, if there was a way to get multiple different vehicles inside of there. That's the only thing that's letting it down. So far, it's not worth the price, but so far it is a really, really enjoyable to play. Um, let's go back to game though, because we've still got a couple more customizations to do. Okay, so I'm sick and tired of being a cement mixer kind of dude. I want to be, I want to be a fire truck. We're going to be a fire truck and we're going to have, this is front, right? I want these to be the biggest kind of wheels that we can have. That's okay. You can hear the fire truck sounds as well. Is there any more parts I missed? Can you have all of these things on? You can, dude. I mean, it's a, let's start from scratch, right? I don't think I don't think the firemen are gonna be. Uh, I don't think the firemen are gonna be ice cream truck dudes, right? So we can definitely put them on, right? Did they? Wait, let's figure out where it goes. Where's it going? Is that on the front? I think it's right there. Yeah, okay. That goes in the front. Oh, there's sirens. Ah, they go right there. So we're going to go with... I think a ladder is going to be needed. Let's go to... We don't want that on. Take the... No, we'll, we'll put the ladder on the back. We don't want the cement mixer on there. So where is that? Ah, at the back. Okay, so we can make ourselves an official fire truck. Dude, that is so cool. 
It's a monster fire truck. That's what makes things even better. You can be a monster fire truck. Now, like I said, there are still many parts to be found. And talking about parts to be found, we just managed to find ourselves one. The fire... I think these are just... What are they? Wheels? They are wheels. Okay, so we found ourselves another set of wheels. They're the most common thing. I think the one thing that I'm actually missing is I think I'm actually missing the monster truck, aren't I? I think that's that's that one at the front. Still plenty more of these to find as well. Um, but I think we will end my map review there because for the people who might want to check this out, I don't want to spoil the locations. It gives you guys something. I'm in the truck. It gives you guys something else to do. I really like the trucks though. So in terms of price, a little bit, a little bit on the expensive side. The reason why I say that is because if you compare this to other maps I've done in the past, I don't think there's enough hours of enjoyment in this map to warrant its price. But that also being said, guys, uh, if you like trucks and you like to build things, this is definitely something I would highly recommend. So they did a good job. Don't don't get me wrong, they did a good job. I'd love for it to have been multiplayer. Uh, I don't. It could be. But it definitely wasn't outlined. So, guys, have a great day. Stay beautiful. Any more maps you want me to check out or review, leave them in the comment section. And, of course, I'll catch you next time. Bye.